Attention all voters in Australia. The federal election is coming up on the 21st of May and never before have so many Australians had a vested interest in making their vote count. And never before have there been such amazing resources to help you, your family and friends do exactly that, make your vote count. I am introducing to you a new website and app that is going to absolutely change the game completely. You are going to be able to go to the polling booth, whether it be pre-poll or on election day, knowing exactly how you want to vote. You can make a beeline to the booth and not speak to anyone in colored t-shirts. You will already know exactly how you want to do it. Now, how is this possible? Well, I am introducing to you, put the majors last an incredible initiative that has been brought together for this election and is absolutely going to change the game. So let me show you how it works. It's impossible for the website to be completely ready as the nominations have not closed and all the candidates have not been announced. However, it is planning to go live on Friday with the information that they already have. And then in the coming weeks with new nominations and announcements, it will be updated. But what you can do right now is you can put in your email here so that when the site does go active, you will get a notification and you can go straight on there and have fun and print your own how to vote card. The absolute best thing about this resource is that you can help the friends and family that you have who trust your judgment. We all have friends and family who agree with us, but don't have the time or don't want to do the research to see who they want to vote for. Now you can find out what their electorate is and print them a how to vote card, send it straight to their phone, email it directly to them and say, here you go. I've done the research for you. All you need to do is follow it. This is an absolutely amazing resource and I thank Jeff Grimshaw for bringing it to us. You will hear a lot more about this over the next coming weeks, but for now, put your email address in so that you get notified when it goes live. And I'm telling you, all the volunteers around Australia who are going to be manning pre-polling and polling booths are going to be talking about this. They are going to be able to help random people print a how to vote card directly to their phone on the spot before they go to the polling booth. This is an absolute game changer, guys. This is exciting. I'm super excited about it. It's gonna be everything that we're talking about and I hope that you are excited too. So here is a trailer to get you even more excited. See you guys on polling days. Hello, before I tell you about PML, let's have a look at what usually happens on election day. Well, first you jump in the car. You have a fight over who is driving. Then you drop the kids off, take a detour, get lost, try and find a parking spot, jump out of the car and walk to the booth. And immediately you get chased by lots of people dressed in funny colourful hats and shirts. And they try and shove these pieces of paper in your hand with boxes and numbers and faces and empty rhetoric and you feel like doing this. And then you head inside and are given more pieces of paper with boxes and names and you just feel like your brain is melting and your head's going to explode and you just want to get it over and done and out of there. And so you end up voting for Liberal, Labour, Nationals or Greens because they're the only people you've heard of. And this is exactly what the major parties want you to do and what they expect. Every three years, you spend two minutes deciding which one party is going to rule over you. But now we're going to change the game to work in our favour. We're going to clean up this mess and rid ourselves of these tyrants. This is where PML comes in. What does PML stand for? Put the majors last. Pretty simple, really. PML will be the go-to resource for the upcoming federal election. You can learn how the voting system works and how to use your marbles to make sure your vote counts. You will be able to search for your electorate and see all the candidates running and there will be links to their websites 
and to the RDA candidate surveys and other assessments, so you know who you're voting for. But the main purpose of PML is to create how to vote cards for you long before you even go to the polling place. And it's really simple. You just choose your electorate, answer a few simple questions about which minor party you prefer and which major party you usually vote for, and then it will recommend a how to vote card for you. Then you can move around the choices, but you cannot move the major parties above minor parties. When we say put the majors last, we mean it. When you're happy, you click to generate the how to vote card, and then you can choose to print it, save it as a PDF or an image, or have it emailed. Then you repeat the same process for the Senate. This can be done on a laptop, a tablet, or a smartphone. And here's the best part. You can use PML to generate how to vote cards for your friends, your family, and your colleagues. You can do it at the pub, at the RSL, at rallies, at university. If you ask just eight people to do this to eight friends and ask those eight friends to do the same the next day and keep repeating that, then in just eight days, every eligible voter in Australia can be covered. Now, some people might say, well, I'm not really comfortable with doing that. Well, guess what? Fighting for freedom has never been easy or comfortable. Sometimes we have to do things that are difficult. In the past, Australians have had to sacrifice far more and do things that were definitely not easy. Our job is much easier. We don't have to travel across the globe to fight tyranny. We don't have to use bullets, only a pen. And we know where the tyrants are. They're right here. And defeating them just requires a little bit of thought and a few conversations with friends and family. We owe this to those that came before us and we owe it to those who will come after us. This is just the beginning. We have a chance to overturn what has been done to us and take our country back. Good luck, God bless, and remember, put the majors last. Authorised by Monica Smith, Reignite Democracy Australia, Melbourne.